Well, when it comes to meals, sharing is caring, and thankfully, our next guest in the Bender Kitchen, I am praying that she shares some of this food today because it smells so darn good. Welcome here, executive chef Sylvia Baldini. She is also the owner of Strawberries and Sage down in New Canaan. Thank you. Uh, tell us a little bit about your uh, restaurant company, catering. You do it all. <laughs> well, restaurant, no, yeah, but it's uh, an event and a catering company, mm -hmm. and uh, it's a great place for me to share my food. I do beautiful events and uh, beautiful dinners. Elegant. Almost as beautiful as you, but not <laughs> Almost, quite. Almost, but so, not yeah, quite. I have to say, yeah. I know your husband's watching, so <laughs> I'm, I'm just kidding. I mean, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Anyways, he's uh, working, you know. Yeah, so no he, problem. He's not saying this. Come on now. <laughs> Whatever. All right. So let's talk about some of the ingredients yes. and what we're going to be cooking today. We're going to make this beautiful braised chicken, and it's a fennel and a cumin uh, chicken, and mm. it's uh, it's a really easy thing because you marinate it the day before. Uh, you stick it in the fridge, you don't look at it, then yeah. you take it out, you cook it a little bit, put it in the oven, and it's done. Well, let's get cooking. Um, do, you, do we need the chicken? Yeah, let me take out the chicken. I'll, I don't I'll get it. You stay Thank over you. There. See, you, you cook start. sometimes. No, yeah. I, I never cook. <laughs> I, I was explaining to her how this is the only time of day where I'm actually cooking is here in the Bender kitchen. Uh, because I'm horrible at cooking. So thank you for being well, I'm going to teach you. There yes, you go. Yes, let's do <laughs> so it. So the, the cool part is I like the Ziploc bag. I'm going to move two seconds here and then give okay. you a spot back. Is okay, thank okay? you. Hey, that's, that's fine. <laughs> I don't want to, you know. And uh, what I do is I put some garlic and some really good um, hot chilies. And then this is a, a good mix of spices. Do you smell it? It's a cumin Ooh, and a fennel seeds and paprika. Now, and are you going to be pouring my coffee in there as well? That's oh, look there. at this. No, no, no put I my coffee down, Sylvia. I haven't had coffee, doing? so I'm a little cranky. Uh, you know, well, feel free that. to have mine. Then, you know, a good thing of pepper, always. Then, you know, a little spray of my uh, olive oil. You, you have like perfume it? olive oil. Well, you have oil. to be chic when you, when you cook. Uh, my kitchen okay. is always like, you so know. So <laughs> shoot it in here? Spray it. A couple spray of those. Okay, Not too much. Uh, you know, that's the Italian way. Yeah. <laughs> I, I actually almost did that, but that wouldn't And then I was going to use this because it's almost Halloween, but, you know, I'll let it go. I like your props. <laughs> yeah, they, my props are good, they right? They look good. They look good. Okay, so put everything in so the bag. So then you massage it a little bit. Well, and you, <laughs> you want to ma massage. Massage, yeah. massage, massage away. Okay, so we're massaging away. <laughs> there you go. Now you lived like all over the country. Or I did. All over the world. You, let me you've just check. You've been to virtually every country. Do you have a favorite? Um, I do okay, love the States. I mean, this yeah. is my one of my favorite. And I was born in Italy, so, you know, they're kind of like, Italy, the States. Mm -hmm. New York, Connecticut. Yeah, you know, obviously kind Connecticut. Of yeah, Connecticut. I mean, hello, it is city style. <laughs> it is the most beautiful. Now it's like the fall. With the fall leaves, time, the foliage, the autumnal beautiful. season. So anyway, usually I marinate this for about 24 hours, so you can do it in the you know the day the day uh, before. Mm -hmm. You don't you stick it back in the fridge, okay. and this like gives a lot of flavor. It's a great way to to get flavor, and and it's actually healthy because you uh -huh. know you don't put anything bad in it. Okay. Then. What you do is, we'll sorry, I'm, I'm stepping on we're you. We're dancing. We're dancing, we're moving. we're moving. Then what you do is you have a nice big pot. I have some onions. You want to put a little more of that. Put more of this in here. Yeah, there you go. You're getting it. You're getting it. You're this, getting uh, it. Is this Chanel or uh, uh, that's Burberry? Old de Leaf. <laughs> old de Leaf. Uh, you, you must be Irish. No, uh, no, no. 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 <laughs> no. And then at this point, you just you know put it in the pot. Mm -hmm. And I'm gonna stick this away because I don't like it. Turn it on. Come on. Don't burn my chicken. And you just brown it a little bit. There you go. With your onions. And then you put some. Can you hear it? I hear it. I, That's the I noise. I can hear it. Let's get the microphone in there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. You know, uh, I went to Cordon Bleu, and the chefs, are, you know, all the French chefs, is like, you have to listen to it. You them. have to listen to you it. You have to listen. That's well, part of it's the a, art, right? It's part of the art. It's yeah. like, a, you know, you know when it's done by the sounds by and the, the sounds. Smells. It's the true. Smell. Then some good fennel, which is a great thing to have. You want to turn? Here, I'll, I'll keep stirring. Mix you keep okay. throwing ingredients in here. Then just a little bit. And when it gets a little brown, what I like to do is put um, a little white wine. You know, there was uh, something on the news today that wine is good for uh, for your heart. Yeah. So that's why my mom drinks a bottle a day. <laughs> Keep the doctor. Maybe one day. glass. One oh, glass. Oh, just one glass. <laughs> one mom, glass. I meant one glass, not one bottle. Just kidding. And then you know what I like to put? It's a uh, very good stock. I like chicken stock, but if you're you know you don't like chicken stock, vegetable mm. stock, whatever. It kind of helps to. I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna be back. Piece of flavor too. I'll be back. Where are you going? Are you, I'll are you be going back. next door? <laughs> no, here. I like it here. Okay, yeah. Please stay. Please <laughs> a little stay. pepper, a little salt, and then I okay. add a little bit of good tomato in there. And can you steer for me mm. a little yes, bit? Yes, absolutely. Although, you know, you need to get somebody to do it for you. I know you want, eventually you're going to get it 
girlfriend that will do this for you. I now, know. Now you have to work. Yeah. For me. Hey, if you're watching <laughs> and you can cook, give me a call because I need someone to cook for me. Because you're gonna be inundated. Or, or maybe you're you. Gonna you. Be maybe you. I'm taken. So, I'm taken. I'm too old for you. All right. Hey guys, for more information. As I get turned down by Sylvia, <laughs> head on over to <laughs> SylviaBaldini.com for more information. An excellent person and an excellent chef as well. And now uh, it smells so good in here. We're going to send things over to Jocelyn. We're going to have to save you some of this chicken, Joss. Absolutely.